At first I said that I love you and you ain't say that shit back It's kinda hard to just trust you when both your feelings don't match Got me showing less emotions, I don't wanna get attached Once I give you my word, I swear it ain't no going back Once I give you my heart, you better keep that shit intact Instead of Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel um, it is currently Saturday and it is 2 10 p.m. I went and rode Apple and Chino this morning. I took a few clips of my phone, so I'll put them in here. And then I came home and I showered and got ready and everything like that because it's actually my boyfriend's birthday today. So I have to go to a dinner tonight. But for right now, I'm sat at my desk on my laptop. But I wanted to say hello to you guys. I'm working on something so special. I'm literally so excited. And I haven't been able to tell you guys for the longest time. That's what's going on. I also have to like get all my stuff figured out for Vlogmas because I have no intro, nothing. Um, but yeah. That is what is going on. Good morning, everyone. It is the next day, Sunday, November 20th. Um, I leave for England tomorrow. And in between then, I've got to finish this project I'm working on for you guys, edit this video and my last video, and I need to fully pack. Oh my gosh. So I just wanted to say hi. I also have to ride today. I'm gonna really get going on this work because I um, slept in today, so I need to make up the time, but I wanted to say hello so that I don't um, start vlogging again at like 4 p.m. Also, I just realized I didn't really explain the reason I'm trying to get all these videos done today is because I always find when I travel to Europe, because we're staying in like hotels and random places, um, there's never ever good internet and it's pretty much the same here to be honest like if we go to a hotel it rarely has like great internet and i don't want to like be sitting here when it says it's going to take eight hours to upload and just wonder if it ever will because it probably won't so i'm trying to get tomorrow which will be monday's video up obviously i would be doing that today anyway but i'm also trying to get wednesday video um done which is this video which i have to film stuff for and then i'm figuring out whether i i just don't think i'm gonna post anything friday or maybe this will go up on thursday instead to like even it out i don't know but i just need to get it done today and i'm also i'm doing my vlogmas intro right now i've done the like outro thing i just need to finish this up so it's ready oh my gosh guys me and my dad are heading out to the barn and we're bringing maya and she's so like crazy about her tennis ball she was paying attention to that and not where she was going and she ran straight into the trash can but anyway this will be my like last ride for a week which is really weird because i think there's only like three weeks in the year where i don't ride the entire week yeah but it's actually quite a good week to do it even yeah. michael said this morning because that... there's not really that much because no, they're off anyway for like thursday friday i think they're working normally, oh really normally wednesday because everybody has thursday off right and friday's yeah. like a holiday as well yeah it'll be good what? Really? <laughs> what's going on huh there's literally no one here because everyone's still at the show that i was at on friday night which you guys saw but i'm here to just yeah. give apple and chino a little sunday ride because like i said i leave tomorrow for england and i'll be gone the whole week and uh i won't be riding hello apple you say hi to everyone to all your friends yes yes <laughs> man that's where chino goes <gasps> nick come here everyone's been asking about you see so you tell everyone that you're okay right he had to have a really little minor procedure, which is why I haven't been riding him, but it's nothing to worry about, guys. It's just literally a very superficial thing. And you'll be back soon, won't you? Yes. 
Oh yeah, there's the pirate boy. <gasps> Hi Ben. Hi. Oh, you're so cute. Anyone wondering, Ben is my trainer's horse, so he's literally still here. And I still go and love on him and give him treats every day. Like, he's mine, but he's not. I just love him. That's what everyone's been waiting for. <laughs> that was okay. Okay, so some updates from the barn. Um, all the, what would you call this, Dad? Panel? Paneling? All the interior paneling. All the interior paneling has been put in it is like um it's like i think it's called board and batten or something so it's all in i believe there's one more stain to be done it they like pre-stain it and then they put the other stain on because you can see like right here it's almost looks uneven but that could just be the light but as you can see here it's like all uneven but um that is what the like actual walls will look like if that makes sense just might not be the color and then up here on either side it is like attic storage space so we'll be able to like store their blankets and stuff up there in the summer and then this not much has been done to this but this will be our little feed room and then you come in here and this will be the tack room obviously they have to paint we just got all this in from Lowe's, I believe it is. Like I said, it's probably this is all gonna be stained, but there will be like a little um, kitchen, like a mini one, like with a sink and a little fridge or something, and a cabinet. So that will go in here. We also have different doors going in here. It's gonna be like front doors, like on the front of a house, because this is the front of the barn. Um, we have once again, it's not stained yet, but a little door, very barny to here this is going to be a restroom so toilet and um sink obviously i apologize it's dark we do not have electricity yet however all the stuff is in we just have to like finish certain things in the barn before you can actually put lights in it's looking good if the lighting would work that'd be even better and uh it's becoming a real barn the things they're waiting for are obviously the stall fronts I will show you when they do eventually get here, but the ones we chose have like, they basically slope down like this so that the horses can stick their heads out at all times. And we also have things going in the window that are like a V. Um, once again, you'll see what I mean when we get it. The outside is painted. This is what it looks like, but all this is gonna be brick all the way around the only reason this right here is not going to be brick is because when we have barn doors they have to be able to slide open a certain way and they can't if the brick's there so that is the barn update for everyone who's been asking we also like redid this drive and have created more area out here it's our front porch we have new posts in finally as you can see um once again have to be stained but they're not those little uh sketchy <laughs> contraptions anymore so it's looking very nice and then that's what i mean is that we'll have like metal things in here and it'll be like a v so the horses can stick their heads out but it's not just like a big open window we're also building this retaining wall because obviously when we took out all the dirt here to make it flat we ended up with <laughs> quite a big slope from there, but we couldn't really do much because all our pool equipment thing is right there. So this wall is going in and there are gonna be stairs here, which are not done yet, obviously, but there'll be like a path up that way. And this will all be evened out because it's like a big hill right now. That is your official update. Hey guys, it is now 3.57. I've been hard at work, but I have not even done any editing. So <laughs> that's something. But I am going out tonight um, because it's my last night here for a little while. I have some people to say goodbye to. But um, I need to pack because our flight is, it's like late tomorrow night and I don't want to be rushing packing. I want to think about my outfits. We are, we're only taking a carry-on bag because I'm sure many of you have heard that right now, like luggage and checking it is like a big problem. Like people are losing their luggage all over the place and I don't want to run the risk of that. So we're only taking a, what is it? 
is it? A carry-on bag, but it's like freezing cold there. So that's an issue because some things are like pretty thick. But basically, I'm not just going to shove a bunch of clothes in my suitcase like I normally do. I'm going to think about each outfit and things that I can wear like with different things. If that makes sense, like mix match it. <laughs> You guys, it is now 5.45. I'm just going to set you down right here. I still have not done any editing, but I did pretty much pack. And I got all my stuff for this project done. So basically, um, stay tuned for the first day of Vlogmas because that's when you're going to get to know about it. But... Um, that's fine. I can, like I said, I can stay up late editing tonight. I can edit tomorrow all day, but this like had to be done. Like worst comes to worst, I can try and upload when I get to the UK. This could not wait. So I'm going to go enjoy my evening and I'll speak to you tomorrow. Hey guys, it's the next day. It is 10.53 a.m. And I just wanted to let you know, I got my video for today up. I got my Wednesday or Thursday video ready. So I got it all done, you don't have to worry about me, but stay tuned because next week you will be seeing my like London video or videos and um, Vlogmas will start and you'll get to hear the big announcement. So stay tuned for that. I love you all so much and I'll see you very soon. Bye. Yeah. Two strong-minded individuals will happen when y'all both reach the pinnacle. Things start to get physical and make it worse.